USA Today and Gallup did a new poll uh, into the Trayvon Martin shooting, and they wanted to see what public opinion was when it came to this shooting. And, um, you know, they questioned their respondents based on race, right? So here are the findings that I thought were most fascinating. So first, uh, when it comes to Zimmerman, whether or not he would be arrested if Trayvon Martin was white, 73% of blacks say yes, he would have been arrested if Trayvon Martin was white. But when it comes to the white respondents, only 33% believe that he would have been arrested if Trayvon Martin was white. God, that's amazing. Uh, you know, that question, to me, the, the better question is what if Zimmerman was black, right? Uh, but what if Trayvon was white is an interesting question. I think 73% sounds about right to me. And you know, and if, if you notice, all blacks don't say, yeah, oh no, absolutely. You know, it's 73%, which is, I think is very reasonable. I'm shocked that it's only 33% for whites. Like, but it really? Goes, it goes back to what we've discussed on this show. There, I don't know if it's just because it's, I think it's because race isn't really discussed as much in the country anymore, right? I feel like for the general public, they believe that we have conquered racism and we've moved past it. But there are so many other forms of racism in the country right now, whether it's institutional racism, whether it's isolated incidents like this, it still occurs. And you need to have that dialogue in order to bring awareness to it. I don't think a lot of people are that aware of it. Yeah, and I think the second factor is that a lot of white people th think you're accusing them. Okay, just calm down. Nobody's saying you would have shot Trayvon or anything like that. Nobody's saying you're racist, et cetera. It's just a question of like, wh wh where do you think we are as a society? And look, it might have also depended on what the white kid looked like. Like if he had tattoos all over him, had rings all over him, maybe the cop thinks, ah, yeah, it was a punk that had it coming, right? Keeping it real, right? Uh, if it's a kid that was like Trayvon and did not have anything like that on him, he just had Skittles in Arizona and was wearing a hoodie like a normal 17 year old wears a hoodie and it was a white kid. Think about it this way, right? Forget whether you think he would have been arrested or not. Do you really believe that if it was a white kid, the cops would have immediately thought, let me check the toxicology report mm -hmm. and the criminal background check of the kid who was shot as opposed to the guy who shot him? If you think that, I, I don't know, I guess I'm gonna ask you to rethink because I don't think that's the reality in this country. Now here was another um, result of the poll that I thought was interesting. They asked the respondents whether or not they believed Zimmerman was guilty. Now surprisingly enough, only 51% of the black respondents said that yes, they absolutely thought that uh, Zimmerman is guilty in this case. When it came to whites, 58% responded that they are unclear. So not yes, not no, but maybe. Maybe. Hmm. That's not as unreasonable. Uh, you know, uh, if you ask me, I think he's guilty, to be honest, okay? Because we've, we're not like the average guy that's seen bits and pieces of the evidence. Uh, we've seen a lot of the evidence, right? Now, does that mean I'm saying we should convict him? No, it just means, of course, he should have a trial. And if I was on that jury, of course, I would have an open mind on it. But looking at what we know now, you know, I would say that my guess would be that he was guilty. Mm -hmm. But I'd have no problem with a maybe answer. Yeah, I don't have a problem with the maybe answer either. I'm actually surprised at how only 51% of the black respondents think, yes, he's guilty. Mm -hmm. Especially with all the evidence that's out there. So, Because we've been trained as a society, which is a good thing, to say that you know nobody's guilty until they have a trial. So I think a lot of people mm -hmm. you know, instinctually go, well, I mean, let's, give, let's have a trial, right? And then we'll find out if he's guilty or not, which is overall a good thing. 